hello everyone this is our question and answer session of our poem nobody's friend so students let's begin the questions and answers question number one what are the things the girl does not want to share the girl does not want to share her sweets book and doll right okay so look at that question number two did the boy share his toffee and tricycle with others no the boy did not share his toffees and tricycle with others right look at that question number three why are the two children nobody's friends why are the first two children were nobody's friends and the answer is the two children are nobody's friend because they do not share their things with anyone and therefore they are nobody's friend look at that question number four why does the child in the last stanza want to share what does the child in the last stanza want to share the child in the last stanza want to share his sweets ball books games apple and cake okay students look at that next question let's talk question number one do you like to share your favorite food or toys with others and why yes i like to share my favorite food and toys with others because i enjoy it very much okay students okay question number two who is your best friend can you describe him or her in your own words yes uh, here for example i have get taken a name of sonu sonu is my best friend he is very smart and intelligent he loves me and likes to share things with me we sit together in the class whenever i have some problems in the i have never i have problems in the class he helps me look at that question number three suppose you and your friends were very very thirsty and there was only one glass of water what would you do students see it is an important question suppose you and your friends were thirsty and there was only one glass of water what would you do and the answer is we shall share the glass of water okay students so look at that question number four if you had a bat could you play cricket by yourself no absolutely not no one can play the game alone we need some friends to play with okay then word building question number one can you find more words ending with a less you have to find out more words ending with a less see friendless homeless are given then jobless careless thankless useless senseless so many of words are there you can write as you can okay then uh, question number 2 can you write the opposite of yes yeah, you want to write the opposite of lend and nobody so lends opposite is borrow look at that answer lends borrow then nobody somebody okay students like that you can complete this activity then uh, next activity what are the what are no words students you just uh, find out no words what is mean by no words no words it means the word never is one and uh, it means at no time or not ever here are some other no words student no words means this words which make the sentence negative the words such as nobody no nowhere no one none nothing etc okay so these are called no one no words so read the given sentence and underline the no word in each line so nobody is at home so no one no one uh, sorry no word is nobody okay then uh, ram has no book no yes it is a no word can no one help me no one what's gopal nowhere around nowhere none of the two boys came none there is a nothing to do nothing i have no coat no and radha is never late so never so these underlined words are said to be no words okay let's look at the next activity say aloud 
say aloud first of all you uh, we will read the uh, words given over here nobody everybody somebody cycle bicycle tricycle chair chair stair hair pair and stair so these are the words given here now write the words that rhyme with just you have to find out the rhyming pairs of the words here for example i have given for you train brain crane brain friend send men bend okay you can write uh, as many as words that uh, you will be possible to write okay so let's write here next question here is a short story once first uh, first of all we will read it once a lion lay fast asleep in the ranthambor forest of rajasthan some mice were playing hide and seek near him one mouse got trapped under the lion's paw the lion woke up laughed loudly and let the mouse go after some days the mouse heard the lion's roar he saw that the lion lay in a great pain as he was tied with the many ropes the mouse used his sharp teeth and cut the rope you are a true friend said the lion so this is the friendship between lion and mice story uh, this story is taken from essence fables right students now look at that question a friend in need is a friend indeed what does this mean and this means that we must be there for friends in trouble we must be there for friends when they are in trouble and only a good friend will be with us when we are in trouble those who are uh, our good friends they will be at with us when we are in trouble okay students here our question and answer session is finished write all the question and answer in your notebook thank you